Hello and welcome to Let's Play Crown Trick. I'm your host, Mefru. So this is a turn-based indie game with roguelike elements to it, produced by Next Studios. So the other day I was just like, I must have you, I must play you, and here we are. So let's start a new game. Saves can increase damage dealt by familiar skills. Okay, sounds cool, I'm learning already. Always like to learn from tool tips and loading screens. <laughs> Electricity to, oh, okay, or not, up. Subtitles, ooh, I love reading subtitles. Wake up, for you're chosen. Damn right I am, when aren't I chosen? <laughs> but the dawn will not grace with her presence those who refuse to open their eyes. Who's there? Yeah, who is there? All oh, right, it's a floating crown. Floating talking crown, shall I say. There is D to move, space bar to interact. Okay, let's go. It was fate that led you to this realm. Now come forward, Ellie. How did you know my name? At least you are cautious. Hopefully the ignorance will become tolerable with time. Ooh, that this. We are currently in the realm of nightmares. Here, I am what humans would consider omniscient. I know everything about you, Ellie. Your name, your past, and even the purpose of your little trip to this realm. Nightmares have brought forth disasters and chaos. As creatures on earth suffer in endless agony, the world itself is on the brink of destruction. As the chosen hero, you're the one they dumped all the responsibilities on. You're the one destined to venture into the unknown and save the whole world. Damn right I am. How do you know all this? Are you in charge of this nightmare realm? Are you the one causing pain and suffering for people? Ever so eager to arrive at erroneous conclusions. How typical of your kind. I think that was another diss. I think that was another diss. Fucking crown. You're in the presence of the observer and guardian of the nightmare realm. I possess no true name, but you may refer to me as the crown. What a surprise. Sorry if I was quick to judge, but it seems I have important work ahead of me. If you really are what you claim, you must have an idea of the culprit behind all of this. Indeed, the nightmares are caused by none other than one of your own. Someone whose heart is filled with greed. A human by the name of Lad. Do you know where he is right now? Patience, girl. Impulsiveness will only lead to failure. It all started with a forbidden sacrificial rite performed by Vlad in the Nightmare Realm. With its seals broken, the power of Nightmare runs rampant, causing death and destruction. Not only in the Nightmare Realm, but in your world as well. My powers can no longer contain it. From what I see, you're woefully underprepared as well. Damn, this guy. He's dissed me like five times in this conversation already. <laughs> Is there anything we can do? Does it mean the world is beyond saving? Uh, I think I have to accept this offer, otherwise we don't really have much of a game. So I accept your offer, Crown, reluctantly. I suppose I could use some help. It's not like you give me any other choice. Damn right you aren't. How impressive. That's the wisest thing you've said since you entered this realm. Now put me on. If you don't mind, let's just depart at once. All right, I'll put you on, sassy, feisty crown. <laughs> Curious. It seems that your body has absorbed every single drop of power I provided for you. What? What did you put in me? Uh, no comment. Such fleeting faith. How fickle the human heart is. Worry not, silly girl, for I have no intentions of doing you any harm. I've simply cast a few spells to further facilitate our journey. You'll understand in due time. If you say so. Yeah, literally, if you say so. Let us go forth, for the fate of both realms now rests within your hands. When doesn't it rest between my hands, or in my hands, or whatever he said? <laughs> right, onwards we go. North. The Nightmare Realm is a different reality, operating on different rules from your world. Here time is relative, it will only flow when you move. So take your time. Sometimes waiting for the enemies to approach can be smarter than foolhardy attacks. This is the most fundamental rule of the Nightmare Realm. You would do well to remember it. I prepared some simple mechanisms ahead. Let's see how well you do. Oh, he does not know me well. The Nightmare Realm operates on a turn-based system. Traps and enemies will remain stationary until Ellie makes the move. I am the king of puzzles. <laughs> oh my god, I've actually mastered this game already. Might as well just turn it off now. <laughs> Ooh, a chest. So if I can throw up. Since we unlock another something. Ah, oh, I didn't want to read that anyway. Spear of Defender. So 23 damage and 5% swirly staff. P def 10 and increases crit chance by 5%. Looks like it's got a two tar radius from what it says on this diagram. Okay, I'll take that. It doesn't seem like you're strong enough to handle any real weapons yet. Here, let me help you with it for now. Your first objective, break those crowns so we can keep moving forward. Alright. Oh, I can actually break it with my body as well. 
Who needs a weapon where you can just thrust into things? <laughs> Look at that. I'm a natural. Slime pup. Take this slime pup. Never saw it coming. And you! Oh, going the wrong way. Remember that you can also change directions in place. Sometimes it's a better option than actual movement. So, change direction in place. Change direction in place will not consume turns. Okay, that's good to know. Change direction in place, you have to hold down shift plus WSD. Okay. I bet I'm going to forget to press the shift button at one point and just fall off randomly. <laughs> I can almost feel it coming. Okay, I didn't do it yet. I didn't do it yet. <laughs> in actual battle, a valid strategy is to wait in place or do an empty swing to force the flow of time. Enemies will have no choice but to initiate the battle by approaching you. Attack them when they are in range. Okay. Skipping your turn can sometimes force enemies to approach, giving you an advantage of attacking first. Okay. Skip, skip, skip. <laughs> Take this bird. That is your real name. I kind of feel sorry for him, actually. He didn't put up much of a fight. <laughs> Here's something you might find helpful. Breaking enemies will make your attacks against them more effective. You can reduce the breakpoint of enemies by dealing damage to them. When an enemy's breakpoint reaches zero, they will be stunned and receive more damage from hits. Okay, so shield is reduced by one point when enemy takes damage. Enemy breaks when shield reaches zero. It becomes stunned and takes more damage. Okay, seems pretty simple. So, smack. That's one. Oh, he's got double down arrow now. It's two. Takes 20% more damage and is stunned. Okay, that's cool. Bam! See you later, slime pup. See you later. Oh. I'm going to get your sister now as well. Take this. And your brother. Oh, take that. <laughs> oh, getting deeper and darker into the dungeon. Who's this guy? Undead Ranger. Enemy is more vulnerable when it's charging or being around you. Damn right it is. Then you can break them quicker. Okay. Attack can reduce more break points when double damage arrow or triple down arrow appears. It appears when the enemy is charging or being around Ellie. Okay, so... Bam! Ooh, damn that damage! Look at that! This guy! He's like, please, just take my lunch money! Just take my lunch money! <laughs> damn! Poor archers. I actually feel sorry for every creature in this place now. I don't know what they're messing with. So the space button interacts with this random thing. Look at her face! What the hell was that? This bottle contains water from the fabled healing fountain. A sip from this elixir will do wonders for your vitality. Both your HP and MP will be replenished from elixir usage, okay? Oh, I took damage somehow. That's weird. Um, hold F. Ooh, 4 HP. Nice. Okay. What are these? Just... Random bits of grass. Random bits of grass. Ooh, purple cats. Whoops. I didn't mean to kill them like that. I, I actually didn't, but okay. Uh, staircase, interaction available. Staircase is opened. Okay, let's go down. Down the staircase. Some skills will require you to select a target location before pressing M1 to activate. Cool. What are skills? <laughs> Tool tip for the future, I think. Oh, I can actually squash them as well. Oh, they're not cats. They're like eyeball thingies. Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> Ooh, boots. I always wanted a pair of boots like this with wings on. Can be like Hermes. Blink boots. Interaction available. Equipped to gain the ability of blink. Why not? <laughs> Her face is hilarious. What the fuck? These are called blink boots, which will allow you to move to specified location instantly. Oops, I forgot the heroic voice. Sorry. However, the usage is limited. Plan it well. Using Blink will not consume any turns. Available Blink usages are shown via the Blink gauge displayed under Ellie. Okay. And that's this yellow thing here, I'm guessing. So, Blink. Blink. Look at me go. Damn. Weak as my powers are right now, I can still replenish the energy of your Blink boots, though only while we are here at the fringe of nightmares. You'll be on your own later on. Okay. Thank you, Crown, for your insightful knowledge as always. Blink is also useful when Ellie needs to get across blocked tiles or tiles with elemental aspects, okay? See you later, blocked tiles. <clears throat> See you later, fire. Nothing's stopping me. Nothing's going to break my stride. Nothing's going to slow me down. Uh, 
Uh, elemental tiles can also cause negative status effects for enemies. I think that's what that was, I guess. Oh, gold. I saw something like randomly explode, but I didn't catch it properly. Okay. Ow. They're literally just suiciding. It's not even fair. Damn. Anyone else smell chicken? It's kind of making me hungry. I think you're looking good. Ooh, boss battle. Fire breather. Oh. Familiars are stronger than normal enemies. Pay extra attention when you're dealing with them. Will do, crown. Crown. <laughs> okay. Okay, it's getting closer. Lava barrel, destroyable. A three by three square area of lava explosion will be generated upon destruction. Why not? Let's uh, face the right way and show you can this. Oh my god! I wasn't expecting to blow up the whole room. Jesus. Okay, I think I complete next to him. He's got the double down arrows as well, so I think he takes more damage. Let me just face her the right way so I don't go into. Oh, here we go. Triple down arrows. Bam! And now he should break on this one. So now he's broken. He takes 20% more damage. How long is he stunned for, does it say? Okay, three turns. So one more. One more. Last one. Okay. Now he's free to do what he wants. So if I run away. <laughs> <laughs> and then blink next to him. Oh crap, I blinked in the wrong tile. No one saw that. <laughs> that did not just happen. Oh my god, where did he go? He just imploded. <laughs> not bad at all. Remember in the nightmare round, defeated familiars will be yours to command. Ooh, I've always wanted to have a pet dragon. Damn, how cool is that? Space to interact. Familiars obtained. Fire breather. It kind of looks like my logo, actually. <laughs> like a fatter version and less cute version of my logo. So, fire blast. Jets fire, dealing 85 fire damage to targets within three vertical tiles and generating fire. What a surprise. Fire blast generating fire. Why not? Potent explosive barrel. Place an explosive barrel which will explode if attacked, dealing 145 lava damage to a 3x3 three three square area around it and generating fire. Okay, they sound pretty cool. Those abilities. Oh, I get to actually use them for myself. It's not like a pet that's using them. So this one's a free tar range. Damn, look at that. Oh, this one's massive range. Look at that. Okay, so if I throw it in the fire, I wonder if it explodes as well. Yes, it does. Okay, that's good to know. I mean, it is called explosive barrel, so you would think it does, but you never know in some games. Good to try out these things. <clears throat> Okay, well, so what's this? Greasy elemental damage taken increased by 50%. Okay. Oh, some random birds there. Hello, random birds. Let's uh, place a barrel here. And maybe if I blink so I don't waste a turn. And then hit that. Oh my god! Finger licking chicken. Jesus, they all got decimated. <laughs> Damn. God, decent performance, but you still have a long way to go. Don't get cocky. Thanks, Crown, for bringing me down a peg. I needed that. Fucking negative Crown. Signal of awakening. Interacti interaction available. A magical teleport that sends you back to the Hall of Reincarnation. Okay. Let's go there. Even though I'm not dead, don't need to reincarnate, but I'll go there anyway. Victory. Fours reached two. Relics obtained. Zero. Damage inflicted. 3,687. That's obviously bugged out. It must be 200 million. Chest obtained. One. Gold obtained. 19. Enemies vanquished. 27. Elites vanquished. One. That's weird. Turns consumed. 306. Not bad for my first run. The score should be a lot higher. Obviously, it's a bug on the a glitch on the screen. But um, yeah, let's carry on. This crown's really creepy and sassy. <laughs> Very sassy. Constantly putting me down. Constantly. Here we are. What is this place? The Hall of Reincarnation. You may think of it as a safe room in between different realms of nightmares. Impervious to the chaos un unfolding outside. Here, we will be able to travel to other dream realms and resolve the anomalies within. How do you suppose we do that? There are no doors to the outside. We're basically trapped here. Uncontrolled naivety is but the same as ignorance. See, he dissed me again. Do humans dream by entering a door? We will be able to travel unfazed within dream realms by falling asleep. 
I suggest you try it by this desk in a bit. Well, thank Crown for your guidance once again. And I think that should be the end of uh, part one. Hope you enjoyed it. Like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. So far, first impressions of the game. I, it just seems really cool. Seems like quite in depth. A uh, lot to learn. I don't have a fucking clue what I'm doing, but I'm enjoying it. So yeah, I'll see you in uh, part two. Take care. <laughs>